ladies and gentlemen, welcome your faces back to another episode of the Mad Pack 2 Hardcore Questing, where we left, um, last episode, at the start of this, uh, this invasion on day 72, 72 day invasion, not the 72 day, the day 72 invasion is what I meant to say there. Oh, and I wanted the cleaver at the end of- Oh, shoot! No! It's night time. Because that's when the invasion happens. They invade at night. And... Oh, shoot. We are... Uh, doing pretty good. At defeating this invasion. Stopping them from coming to steal and ruin all of- Oh, you can hear sounds for- Oh my god. Come on, let's just drop down here. Quickly return, just so it doesn't spawn us any, uh... Any other dudes. Oh my god. That was the most amazingest shot ever. I cannot I cannot mess with those spriggans. Those spriggans have got life drain. That will uh that will get in our way. So, let's not do that. Come on, dude. Get him. Damn it. We need to we need to get all of these gone so then they stop destroying your house and then we can probably go back in. Oh shoot! No, this guy, come on! Come on, I'm seriously gonna make that cleaver. Guys, we're gonna make that cleaver uh, today as well. Manual and cleaver. Um, maxed out on as much damage as we could possibly put on there. So then, all of these mobs without that uh, that armor, which are uh, probably most of the Lycanites mobs, we can do actual good damage to them. Not 24 with our little rapier. A rapier sacrifices um, high end damage for uh, armor pierce. And so these guys that don't have armor, we're just wasted. The damage is just wasted on them. Okay, let's get this dirt. Oh, yeah. And now look, see if we can knock this back at somebody. Let's knock it down at the lava there. Floating. You can hit it. Did I get it? Oh, you could knock it. You can knock them. Actually, shit, we need to kill this guy. Can I knock it? Oh, nope, nope, that one's just glitched out. That one's just fully glitched out. Not even half glitched. Alright. And... Really? I kind of feel like the invasion's already done. Damn, being able to fly and have an amazing bow like that makes your, makes the invasion incredibly... Whoa! You don't like me anymore. These dudes don't like me anymore. Because I killed your bro. Just because I killed your bro, man. Really? Oh, man, I didn't mean it. I made you. I made you. Headshotted. So, thank you for all the help. But now, you've turned on me. They turned on me. And they paid for it. All right. So I don't need any of this stuff here. That can go there. We can finally make our... um. A fire resistance now that we have some peace jinxed it no more peace for us but he's gonna come and invade us the not oh god please don't so that one that one that one all right we're ready to make it we are ready to make it the fire charm uh, was that one there and BAM we've got it and now you can fit yourself into the boots there if you like yes and they do keep their enchant remember that so let's go protection on protection protection absorption soul bound. Oh, we could put more enchants on these. We never did that. And oh wait, you're not getting enough power. Maybe I need to put it on the other side. Thought it was in the open enough. There you go. Right, so that's gonna cook that junk that we, we that we got last time. Um, as a Visio sword, did we make that? No, we got the Imperio. So the next one up is a Visio. We can craft that right now because we're we're all gemmed out. Armor is jammed out. Cannot put any more in there. So I guess that's the next step. Let's do that. So then we at least have it. Uh, and then we could work on making it jammed out and a maximum amazing. How close are we? Come on. How close are we? Oh, not really. We got three. We need a ton more Imperio to get us to the four. And then we could put a... Oh, we couldn't. I think you need to put an actual, um, higher-end gem in there. Like 
Yeah, he's, I don't think there's a way to get him out. So I need to either... Need to either go for gold or nothing at all. I think that's the that's the way that we need to do it. Um, so the quest book, I can put in the thing that I don't need, that I don't need. I don't need some of this junk here. Um, that's kind of junk, junk, junk. And the experience, yeah, I'm just gonna throw that on the ground and use it. There we go. And sword, I'd love to put a chance on you, but you're probably not gonna be that, the great, right, the greatest right now. Once uh, you get, once you get a little bit better, we'll, we'll use you then. So a cleaver, a maxage damage cleaver is what I want. Um, and there's five ingots of manulin in there to solve that. Manulin. Bucket of manulin, put the bucket in there, it'll drain out into there. Oh, we got 12 in there now. Beautiful. Man, I don't know how many buckets I'm gonna need, so I'm just gonna grab like two more. I think that was a bit over six each. Yeah. Alright. Now the manulin is the most damage, the most damaging of the uh, the sword head. Uh, blade? Sword blade? Is this gonna tell me the damage? No, you're not. But the, uh, the manual and head there is gonna be the way that we, we need to go. Uh, we do not- uh, oh, ooh, I'm gonna need one of those. I'm gonna need a large rod. I don't have one of them in there yet. So if we got gold in there- Yeah, we do got- we got two- oh god, we need more gold in there. We'll grab a bucket of gold as well. Um, gold? Nope, um... Bucket of gold. Molten gold. Molten gold bucket. Definitely not that much. Just a couple of them. And that will go in there. That one as well. Alright. Now, 23. That's a little overkill, and that's the way I like to roll. So I need myself that, the cleaver, the large blade, large blade there. And we're gonna need the the tough binding, is it? So I need the tough binding. No, I don't. I just need two two rods. So the rods, they're probably gonna be out of manulin because that has the best. That has a lot of durability. That has the best durability, I believe. So I'm going with that. So I need to make one of those. Did I? Oh, I couldn't grab it out because I need to grab that shit out. And that one there. I need to cast both of these. That one can stay there. So you and you need to get casted in the gold. Is the gold on the bottom? The gold is on the bottom. And I can put... Oh, wait. Nope. Can I put you there? Now, that was the, the rod cast. I need to do the sword blade in gold. Is there a bin? Let's get one over here. Trash can. You can go in there. I don't need that. Uh, yeah, I no longer need that. The buckets I do. And now manulin. I want you to be manulin there. Thank you, sir. And I need to cast one of these next. So it's gonna be pretty much manulin. Um, actually paper. It's gonna be paper as well. So manulin for the blade. I'm kind of second guessing and going for uh, for paper now because we can add additional modifiers with that paper there. Let's let's have a look at the difference between them. We'll make them both. Um, paper. Things construct. Grab out some of that. It's a hell of a lot of paper. So with that I can craft not the blade but tough rod. Can I make two of those? Two tough rods and maybe a wooden pl uh, plate like that. Alright and we'll compare that maybe to the uh the manual version of it all. Uh, so I do need this. I don't need that anymore. We've already cast that one. Grab that. Second manual. Full rod. Grab that one. Switch that up for that. If I got enough manual in there, I do. I do indeed. And I don't need that or that anymore. All right, let's check this out. Let's see which one is better for us. Grab that. Now, 
in here. Can I make that, that, and that? That's going to give me 16,007 hearts damage. If I switch that up, that'll drop me down to 5.5 hearts. So I'm probably going to have to keep that up there. Because I want all of those hearts damage. But I feel like I'll be able to switch this out and not lose any... Yeah, right. So then we get an addition. We get four modifiers there and we don't lose any hearts damage. So I'm going to... I'm gonna probably do that one. Keep the paper and paper way down, way down to 2,000. That's fine. We're gonna roll with that one. Manual and cleaver are writable. We're gonna name that. Sawag. Ness. Sawagness. And that's gonna be hopefully insane. Now, um, can I leave some crap? Oh, wait, no, let's not leave it in there. I can smelt that in there. And the large paper I can uh, get rid of. Now we need to upgrade this. Uh, probably, probably going to put RF on it. So let's let's do that first. Blurks. I'd love to put that one on there, but I think I'm going to have to go for the a lower one. I can do that. I can do four. I cannot do that. All right. So 400,000 flux on that one there. I don't want to put this one on there because that's only 80,000 flux. We want to go all the way for the 400. That's awesome. Then I can't do this one. This one's 4 million. That would be amazing though. Uh, but I need a shit loads of quartz. And I also need... Should we... No, we don't need to... We don't need to fortune that at all. No, we're not in need for fortune at all. So I'm not going to do that. I'm going to just quartz it, quartz it, quartz it. And... I need Kian Salt to add additional modifiers. I need a diamond block and a diamond. And then I need a gold block and an apple. So a gold and a gold. All right, now this can all add additional modifiers as well. That adds an additional modifier. We see we go from four to five modifiers there. And then, then uh, that one and that one go to six modifiers. And then this will take me to seven modifiers of amazingness put that in there seven modifiers of amaze and now quartz quartz and quartz quartz nether quartz nether quartz oh wait we'll just grab a little bit of that i'll do that because i need to grab it from in here that's the quartz that i want block of quartz that hopefully is enough <laughs> <laughs> that stupid amounts. All right. Now, this is the easiest way to put it all on quick. If it is a multiple. No, it's not. Oh, no. It's going to be annoying as hell. So, in that case, can I do six? Is this the way that I should do it? Because I want to... I don't know how to explain it. Yes! It's perfect. Alright, so then I can just keep going. See? When it changed over, I want it to be... I don't want to have to... Take out port blocks here. I want to be able to just keep it as a multiple of um, the, the 72. So then... Uh, the 72 quartz to, to level up from one level to the next level is what I mean. Oh my god, I, I had no idea. I, I didn't explain that at all very goodly, muchly. Apologies. Just, if you're doing this, do this. And... <laughs> 21 hearts of damage! Oh my god, swag! Which is uh, quite a bit. That is 43 attack damage on our sword. That is a hell of a lot more than the 21 on there. That is more than double. That's amazing. All right, put all that crap back. And it's got RF. I need to power it up. Like, super power it up. Um, it will... Oh, wait. This is a 4 million now. Right, so it's not going to drain it. If I hold it in my hand, it'll power up. But if I power it up any faster... That's got 300,000 RF in it. Oh, wait. It's going pretty fast. Pretty, pretty fast. Anyway... Has I got a 5,000 RF out? No. 800 RF out. That's all. Alright, let's just hold it in your hand. That's good enough. Time to get ourselves to the nether. 
Repair that one. Oh wait, we are uh, also also while I'm here, manual learn. Oh, I had the block of quartz in there. I was wondering why I couldn't get manual in out. Grab four of those and uh, repair my uh, my arrows there. They got self repair on them, but you know what? We got stacks of manual and we're not in need of of EMC anytime soon. Speaking of EMC, I kind of want to take this. I kind of want to start all this again. Just because look how much we got in here. 1.5 million. In 19. Oh my god. That's over 20 millions. Over 9,000 is what I meant to say there. Alright, let's get a uh, another portal rolling. Uh, obsidian blocks? Really? Really? How can I get some obsidian out of this? Is there standard obsidian? That's not frequency. No frequency. Mm, no frequency. Nope, not what I want to do. I want to put something in there with about 64 EMC. 64 EMC. EMC. <laughs> So I think that's uh, how much obsidian and a um, how much EMC an obsidian block has. Obsidian, no. If I could take out maybe something a little smaller. Obsidian block. B? Is that is that not not? Is that a block of obsidian? Block of... No, it's not a block of obsidian. It's actually obsidian. Alright, now how the hell are we going to do this? Move things around, put things in there. That's frequency. That's frequency. I don't think that that frequency stuff is gonna work. But we should give it a try, actually. It's 66 EMC. It's a different EMC to the actual... What? It's... EMCs. Maybe that will work. Do you have normal EMC there? Just not normal, normal obsidian there. Just straight up obsidian. Is that a filter out, though? Is that a filter out? If I put it there, will it filter it out? No, 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 that's all Klein stars and stuff like that. It's not going to filter it out. We're going to get all the frequencies there. 845. But not one that I want. Is there EMC a little higher than that? Nope, they're all 66. I can find something with 64 EMC. Sixty-four EMC. What has um redstone? <gasps> Obsidian? <gasps> oh my god! Now, if you want to be a bus, that is how you do it. And I need flint. Flint and steel to get us through there. All right, and. Possibly look at making some soulbound uh, books if I can with all my levels that I have before we go so we can put that on our, our armor there. We got no soul bound it's absorption projectile. No, no soul bound, really. I've got it on that piece there. Maybe I can pull it off there and put it back on. So if I get a book, that many books, see if I can take it off with the anvil. Is it gonna be the first one to come off? Are you? Oh no, you're gonna be protection. I guess we could, we've got plenty of levels. We could try and, oh God, it's the last one. Oh no. So then I need to put all this back on with all of the levels I currently still have. There you go, and I need to copy Soulbound if I can in there. Oh, wait. We do it like that, right? Yes. Two. Last one. 
There we go. All right, now soul bound. You can go on the chest plate there. You are soul bounding. It's all binded. I need that piece, that piece, and that piece. And then you, my friend, can soul bound. You can also soul bind. And so can you. Oh, God, nice. All right, beautiful. Everything's soul bound there. there. This kind of stuff is not. But we have 22 levels left. We should probably do that, right? I should have probably... Probably not noobed out and made an additional book, right? Probably made an, an extra book. So then, next time, we don't have to worry about doing that. And uh, that, wasting how many levels? Jesus. And switch that up. Right, there we go. We have uh, an extra book. Two, three, a couple of books. Uh, can I take one book out and another book out? That's brand new that it, does, it works properly like that. Nice. Oh, wait. No. No, no, no. There we go. You are now soul bound. Awesome. And I can soul bound bind anything, right? Anything at all. Okay, not in this version then. Not in this version then. That was a complete waste of all of, <laughs> of all that extra experience. Trollolololol. -lo -lo. Anyways. Let's put that away, get ready to go and make ourselves a portal to the nether. Get rid of that, just, just because it doesn't need to be here anymore. Um, if, oh, if I block this off, we can do it down here. Oh, wait a minute, but it's, it's, pro things, things are going to come through. Evil things are going to come through, but that's okay. Um, they're allowed to come through down here, I guess. They don't need to can get rid of that. And can I obsidian this up in the frame like this? And there we go. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful fit right there. Probably going to need a light on it or two. And then it's also going to need to be sparked up. Ready? Oh, all right, guys. That is the end of the episode. Next episode, we go through to the nether. And we're gonna need some serious protection. But we got it. And we're gonna do it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen. Oh no, don't take me through the nether! Whoa! The phantom is controlling me! Oh shit, that could be bad. He could he could port us through the nether. <laughs> when we don't wanna go. Alright. Well, um that is gonna prevent us from getting sucked in there. Thank you all and I'll see you next time.